Hello everybody, Flash Rick here, got Nightfall, hey guys. Going back into some more Banjo-Kazooie. Uh, we're going to pick up back at Freeze Easy Peak again. Uh, hopefully I can actually finish the level this time, since, you know, I died too many times last time. Those snowman snipers, I'm telling you, man. Yeah, dude, They're terrible. I hate the snowman. But we still got five more jiggies to get here. I'm probably going to get at least two more here, maybe more. I don't know. Uh, I've been doing pretty well on my jiggy count, so I can technically skip some here if I need to and come back later. Yeah. Uh, Are we trying yeah. to go for 100% completion? I can't remember. No, not 100%, but the thing is, you need like a really high jiggy count and feather count in order to actually get to the final boss. Oh, uh, so yeah. There's that snowman there. It's better to uh, get it done early and get as many as you can early for the later levels that are terrible. <laughs> so I hate how they have boots on that side, but not this side. Yeah. Wake up! My turn. Okay, come on. I'm just not meant to go up there. Uh, I was gonna say, I thought that, that You already got those, didn't you? Uh, I don't think I got it here. Maybe I did. Yeah, I think you did. Oh, I guess I did. Oh wait, there's three. There's three I can get. Uh, I'm going all fat. Got big teeth. Her, her. Man, he is mean. Okay. So I know. I can talk to the walrus, he can give me one just for being a walrus, because he's racist. <laughs> um, I can do the sled race, but I don't want to pull my hair out. Because... I was about just about to ask if they would start so gross that they do. Oh yeah. <laughs> they hate everyone. Give me alone, Ice Cube. I don't like your rap career. Oh, hey, it's another. Kind of. Remember, if there's anything. I don't think there's a diggy in the water. Yo, what up, walrus? Ah, another walrus. Take this. I'll watch out for a smelly brown bear. Smelly brown bear? Who are you talking about? No, who are you talking about? That guy sounds like a jerk. I forgot he has this cave in here. I think there's a jiggy in here too. Oh, again, Mr. Walrus. Feel free to have a look around. Ah, oh, the Jinjo's in here. Okay, so there's a Jinjo I can grab. So that, that'll give you your next jiggy, right? Uh, give me one jiggy. He just gave me six. But so six, that'll be number seven. Uh, eight if I beat Polar Bear Bro, but I'm not going to lie. It's actually a fairly hard race. Yeah. It's kind of like the, uh, Rare, the slide yeah. in Mario 64. Rare is the... Well, the slide in Mario 64 I can beat fairly easy. Oh, I can Rare definitely. is notorious for having, like, terrible, terrible freaking racing mechanics in these games. Hey, that's an extra life. Uh -huh. Where's the finish line? Where's the starting line at? I know I'm going to probably lose this right off the bat. 
Are these reds? Stupid bear. Oh my lord, I did Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> Never mind, I guess I don't have to do it again. But see what I mean though, like it was very close guys. <laughs> okay, I need to race on my own size. Woo! Okay, there's seven. I can't remember. I thought there was something else I could do. I feel like there's a jiggy in the water somewhere. So I'm gonna look around at the walrus for the jiggy. The jiggy! For sure, there's that big icicle dude up there. I can't remember if there was one up there or not. How many do you have now? You have eight there. now or nine? I'm at seven. Eight seven. would be uh, if I uh, beat this or grab that ginger, it would be eight. I can almost guarantee that killing all those snowmen yeah. have one. I'm probably not gonna do that because the aiming mechanic when you're in the bird bomb or whatever is terrible. Don't you have to get all the puzzle pieces to win the game? No, you need 90, I think it is, or maybe it's it's like 85 or 90. I know it's fairly higher. Alright, transform me back. I still think it's funny that he switches sides if Grunty gets. Yeah! <laughs> if he dies, he will. Hey! Yeah. <laughs> hey! Run fast! Ooh, that gave me like no time. Oh, there's just enough time to get across. I can't remember if I can challenge. I think I can face bottle or the uh, polar bear again now that I'm a bird. Can you give you another one? I think so. I could just be making things up too. I don't remember. I do like the aesthetic of this level, like how you can climb the scarf up to the mm -hmm. uh, snowman. The Christmas tree in the corner with the lights. Like even though it's a different company, you can tell that Rare, I don't know what came out first, if it was Mario 64 or this, but you can tell that both games either yeah. drew heavily from one another or... Mario, Mario 64 came out first, and Rare made this game because they wanted this to be a better version of Super Mario 64. Super like, Mario they, 64. They, like they wanted to beat Super Mario 64. And I think they did. Mario, Super Mario 64 is great, but I love 
these games more. Yeah. And it's technically a different company, but they were both owned by Nintendo at the time, so it makes a little bit more sense that you know they had the creative rights to do it. Yeah. I wish you could shoot eggs while in that one. I think it'd be easier. Uh, if I got the in this one you can't, but in the second one you can. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I was gonna say this is probably all 100 of these, isn't it? I think so. If not most of them. Six, seven, and eight. Yep, this should be all. Do you get a Do you get a puzzle piece for getting all those? No, I can't remember. No, you just need these to unlock yours. <laughs> Uh oh, you're getting low on life. I know this is low on life. Nope, you get nothing to kill on them. <laughs> Oops. And you drowned. And I drowned. <laughs> Alright, well, that's fine. Well, I don't want to do that. Okay. I think. Try to do the race one more time, or? I'm going to talk to him. I'm, I'm definitely going to grab the Jinjo. I want to talk to him. I think I can race him one more time. I could be wrong on that. Okay, he specifically said I should race him on my own side, so. Oh! Yeah. Sniper snowman. Hey buddy, fancy a race against Boggy? Oh no! There's racing shoes! But I can't use them yet! Can you not beat him without those? No, you can't. Yep. <laughs> How do you get the racing shoes? There's a level you gotta do. Uh. Now, now, I didn't want to do that again. <laughs> I'll screw you. You back out is what I want to do. I, remember, I don't think I missed the racing shoes anymore. Wait, wasn't that in the crocodile mini game thing? No, that was the uh, boots. Oh. This level, you mean? Yeah. Or not for this level, but the uh. Oh, oops, oh, please, please. Oh, I was out there to go to Gobi's Valley to learn. I know you got me at Gobi's Valley. Is where we're going next? Where could you be missing? Right now? I want to grab that ginger and we'll go to Gobi Valley. Okay. Is that supposed to be his feet or like his voice doing that sound? I think it's his voice doing it. 
Like whenever you jump. Oh, oh yeah. Eat the bear again. Take that noisy orange thing. There's the ice key. What's that? That's one of the swap, top of swap things. Oh yeah. Stop and swap item for later. How about no? And the stop and swap was something that was exclusive to the 360 game, or they tried to implement it in 64, but they Nintendo kind of told them they probably shouldn't. Yeah. So there was a little bit in that game, but uh, it's it's fully in the 360 uh, games because you can also use it for uh, um, nuts and bolts. Okay. Which didn't, no, nobody really liked Nuts and Bolts, right? It's kind of had a little bit of a renaissance. Um, from what people have said, it's a bad Banjo-Kazooie game, but a good, like, independent IP. Because everybody wanted, you know, Banjo-Kazooie, and that's not what it is, so. Yep. If they made, like, an original title, it probably wouldn't have been too bad. But. Yeah. Break open presents. Jump in the paintings like in Mario. <laughs> <clears throat> it didn't work. I loved the sound that Mario made every time it got kicked out. Oof. Oof. Let's find a way to scream that at some point, too. Yeah, that'd be fun. I know we can on a Switch, but we don't have one. Well, my brother's got one. I'm sure he'd let us borrow it. Yeah, yeah, and he's got the 64 collection, so. <laughs> How do you get down in there? Do you gotta like what smash? I think it's a move I gotta learn. Uh, right, back uh, down to Gobi's Valley. I uh, see. Gobi's. I think they didn't reverse game, guys. I think Gobi was supposed to be next, but oh well. Is that supposed to be a lion or a bear? A bear. It's a bear. <gasps> I'm trying to remember where it's painting it. So. Do you like it's behind one of these? I'm probably wrong on that. Uh -huh. This is for Ding Pot, I think, right? There we go.
Gooby's Valley. I just can't remember where the actual painting is. Ooh. That interests me. Reminds me of the lava temple in Ocarina of Time. Mm hmm. A little like that. This interests me to. There it is, Gooby's Valley. Oh, we get to go to an Egyptian world. Mm hmm. I used to study Egyptology a lot when I was a kid. It was uh, my favorite uh, uh, mythology. Mm -hmm. Like I, most people like Greek or you know Viking. I always loved Egyptian mythology. It was pretty cool. Uh oh, I'm dead. Lava does that to you. Okay. I think I have enough to unlock at least one more. How many levels or worlds? You said there was ten worlds? There's nine or ten, I can't remember. Nine or ten. Crazy Easy was number five. Uh, Gobby's number six. This is number seven. Actually, listen, tell us. One second. There's Mumbo. One, two, three, four, five. This is Crazy Easy Peak. Six. Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, there's nine. So. The Gobi's number six. This is number seven. Then there's Resi Butt, Gabe, and Click Clockwood. shows up your uh, Banjo-Kazooie controller thing you were thinking about. Yes. Uh, did you end up getting it? Oh yeah, I did. You did? Okay. Uh, I got a Banjo-Kazooie controller holder that's currently on the way. 
I don't know when it's supposed to arrive. Hopefully, soon. Ow, dang it, I can't come in here yet. I can make it. No. <laughs> nope, I can't. I do all that walking again. I forgot, I gotta transform and do uh, something in the horror world in order to get over there. Horror world? <laughs> yeah, horror. Yeah. It's like a Halloween themed one. Oh, I'm dead again. <laughs> Went from having five lives to two lives. <laughs> Go have another game over screen, guys. Your sister wants Ooh. to talk to you. Ooh, almost fell again. Okay, so then the uh, painting or the Halloween world must be up top here. Run from Donkey Kong. Run. And I'll run. Run so far away. Uh -huh. Rusty Bucket Bay. That's the entrance truck here. Rusty Bucket Bay. Ah! Dave wants to know what we're recording today. Uh oh. I said Banjo and Stardew. Banjo, Stardew, and Super Smash Bros. if he comes down here. If he had a car, he probably wouldn't. <laughs> He's got a new school word, unfortunately. Sorry, Gabe, if you're watching this. What room is this? That's a spooky Yuki. Ah, mad monster me. Okay, this is how I get into here. That's the horror level? Yeah. Mad monster me. It's very dark. You might have to turn the brightness up a little bit. Almost here. Hard to be some strong or something. That reminds me of uh, Nightmare Before Christmas. I don't know why. The little hill. Mm -hmm. Kind of reminds me of that. Oh, they could have been inspired by that. I don't know. It's very possible. I don't think we have enough rusty bucket bay. I only got 10 left. Could be wrong on that. I was about to find out. The bucket bay one's right up here, so we'll find out real quick. It's a banana. What movie is it from? I don't remember actually. Tarzan. Oh, the little, so, the little it's been so long since I've seen Tarzan. I think I remember that though. I can't do Rusty Bucket Bay yet because I need to open up water. To do that, I gotta do one of these other levels. Alright, well, we got the next two levels unlocked though. Sweet. Is it right in here? It may be right in here. No, it's not back in here. Alright. 
Oh! Uh, my ankle! Alright, so I go back down to Gobi's back. Alright. So that finished up Freeze Easy Peak for the most part. And. Yeah, sorry, sorry. Alright, that's free to Freeze Easy Peak and everything else. We'll start the next level over at Gobby's Valley. So until next time, talk to you all later. See you guys.